Hello. Well, we all know what food we like to eat, but do you know what cows like to eat and what we feed our cows? Do you think it's A, grass, B, chips, C, sandwiches, D, beer, or E, sugar? Well, if you said grass, you'd be right. But if you said any of the other four, you wouldn't actually be that wrong. Let's go and find out why. Now we can't leave our cows out all through the winter because it's far too wet and far too cold for them. So during the summer months, we have to cut our grass and collect it all up and put it into huge, great big heaps like this one here. And we use this to feed our cows all through the winter. And this is what we call silage and cows just love it. So as well as for just silage, we feed lots of different things to our cows, like straw. Now we grow our wheat crops to make flour for our bread and straw is the stalks that are left over. And we bale that up into those bales there and bring it into the farm. And some of it's used for bedding our cows and some of it, this here, we're gonna chop up and put into our cow feed. And straw isn't the only leftover that we use. Here's a heat ready for in our feed mix tomorrow. When you buy oils for your cooking, like rapeseed oil and soya oil, they squeeze out all of the oil from those seeds and what's left is this here. And we use this for feeding our cows as well. Now this heap here is the mash that's left over from making beer. The barley is put into hot water and they squeeze out all the juices to make the flavour for lager. And this is what's left over and cows love eating this. We even feed the leftovers from making sugar. This huge tank here is full of a liquid called molasses. That's the black treacle that's left over from making sugar. Potatoes that aren't good enough quality to use, that are damaged, like these ones, or other vegetables like carrots, are used for feeding our cows. As is wheat that's been sent to the flour mills and been rejected because it's not good enough quality, or even loaves of bread that haven't been sold. Our cows really are the most amazing creatures. They have managed to recycle all those leftover products from our food processing industries and convert them into something nutritious and tasty for us to eat. So tonight, when you're having your supper, whether it be chips or something cooked in vegetable oil, a sandwich, or maybe a spoonful of sugar on your pudding, just think, the food you've eaten tonight has helped me feed my cows and produce the milk for your breakfast tomorrow morning. Let's go and have a taste of some now. Now, as much as I love my milk, one way to make it even more delicious and healthy is by making a milkshake and adding some fresh fruit. And what's better now that our English strawberries are coming into season? So let's add them in there. Now when it's really hot in the summer, you can make this even better by adding a little bit of ice cream too. Delicious strawberry milkshake. Why don't you have a go at making your own flavours and creations and leave a comment below tell me what you enjoy. Or better still, show me your milk moustache.